Okay, so now moving on to the fight scene. Richard laid on a cardboard, a piece of cardboard, so it was easier for us to pull him along. And Noah stood on top of Richard um, the whole time filming. Where'd he go? <laughs> no! <laughs> this was kind of a difficult scene to film because of the fact the door would close if nobody was holding it open and we had to figure out whether or not Richard's foot would be there or not. So we figured the system out where Justin would be the one pulling and then he would hold open the door while I walk through so Noah can step over Richard and go in and film me for this part. If you haven't seen The Kingsman, there's this church fight scene where the camera just follows Harry. We took a lot of inspiration from that because what we wanted was a wide angle kind of fight. So we tried to mimic the similar kind of style. And I also increased the shutter speed to around 100. We wanted it to be in the style of a one take. We used editing techniques like Birdman where you would see the camera swoop over and in the swoop, there would be a cut. So it's called a whip pan. How he wanted this scene to go down was Noah would record some of it and then he'd have to hand over the camera to me because of the fact that he was also in the scene. Okay, so you could see right here, um, this shot, Justin's leg did not connect with Justin. Um, they're both called Justin. I don't even like chocolate. I don't even like pie. Why would you ever think it's me? But Justin's leg did not connect with Justin. I had to manually extend his leg out a little bit further just for a frame so you can kind of feel like there was a little bit of a hit there. So there's a little bit of stuff Kingsman inspired that I did here. Usually in the fight scene, you can see these really, really like big zoom-ins where it'll focus on some something or the camera will move along with the actor. And that's what we tried to do here, but most of it was done um, in After Effects or in Premiere Pro. Justin, look, I'm fucking strong. Go, do it. Are you ready? Wait, no, sorry, sorry. It's from here, it's from here, it's from here. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. I can't believe it. so far! Hey. He's so far! This scene we had to shoot several times because we needed to do it all in one take because there weren't really many moments that we got to hide cuts in there. The original choreo was that Richard would... Yo, what's up? Just got interrupted. Okay, so Justin came to join us for the fight scene breakdown. <laughs> okay, um... <laughs> Right now, I'm, I'm talking about this scene right here. Richard, when, Richard, when Richard pushes you, that's uh, a new thing that we added into the choreo because of the fact that I needed to squeeze past you and Richard. Like, you were here and Richard was behind me and I, and I needed to squeeze in between you guys with the camera and Richard needed a little bit of a buffer, so he had to push you. Three, two, one, action. Oh. 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 Oh, no. All the falls were done um, on mats. We had this memory foam mattress that we put pillows on top of. And as long as there wasn't one point that hit too hard, um, you were good. So we have Jojo getting ready to fight Emmy. As you can see, this is mirrored because if you don't know what the 180 degree rule, it's basically if you have two subjects, the camera is on one side of them. And in the corner, Alvin, our fight choreographer, is still standing. Whenever we were filming these scenes, everyone would just stand around the corner. Everyone would just wait to come in. So they're all standing around the corner waiting to do their scene. But sometimes, occasionally, a person would pop in and out. All right, ready and action. Yo, what kind of cake do you like? So this shot 
Obviously, JoJo did not jump on Richard's back. Richard would have a really bad time waking up the next morning. We know that's so high. Oh, not so high? Oh, so I'll go like that. I kind of want to go up to here. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, Yo! What? <laughs> What we did here was Jojo stepped on the recycling bin. She jumped, she kicked. Alvin had a back scratcher that hooked onto the uh, recycling bin. And the moment she jumped off of it, we timed it where the recycling bin would get pulled to the side. So when she lands right here, you don't see the recycling bin anymore. Pull back a little bit, and then you, you hit her with the boom, and then she like just. Yeah, but um, the box is in there. I don't know if someone could just like, yeah. like move it yeah. to the side. <laughs> oh my God! Oh, phone just got leveled. Oh, yeah. yeah. Push it that way. Push it that way so you can't see it anymore. And then I'll try to get on this side so like Alvin will quickly get out of the way, and then I'll be over here, and then I can film the rest of that. Right here, we tried to do a light flickering effect because the fact that. Our two actors had to leave at that time, so they couldn't be there for that day. And the dorm closes the lights at a certain time. So, lights out. Jojo gets kicked in the wall, lights back on. And that way, it'll kind of hide the fact that the lighting has changed a little bit. All right, right over here. Um, this was all filmed the day after. We just asked all the actors to come in, bring the same clothes, and redo the scene again. And this whole fight scene choreo took about two hours the next day for a 10 second clip. It all paid off in the end because it looks really cool. And as you can see in the background, that is not Noah. That is Alvin. Noah couldn't make it for this thing in time. So we had to dress up Alvin as Noah. We put sunglasses on Alvin and he kind of like <laughs> made his hair a little bit more like Noah's, but seals the deal because of the fact that it's really fast and also nobody can tell. No, don't do that. And right here at the drop, there was also the memory foam mattress right there. I was stepping on it as I was recording. Okay, so right here, we filmed the scene where Justin gets back up. Um, so this took several takes, but we, I thought it was really funny if Noah would be like this invincible guy who after like taking all these hits, you know, like nothing would happen to him, like Terminator 2 kind of style. So I'm, I'm taking your place like here. Mm -hmm. So it's like, okay, go. Yeah. And then go around. Oh, I'm sorry. It's right, it's right. And then basically he does groin kick. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and again, Justin gets thrown over onto the mattress. I come in with shaving cream, not cake. It's supposed to be cake. So we only had one take for this thing. So if anything got messed up, Noah would have to clean up again and we wouldn't, we didn't have shaving cream anymore. This was also difficult because nobody has really fa like fallen down completely straight back. But we, we thought it was really interesting because it really added to his character, how like he was like really stiff and robot-like. Guys, I got it. Yeah, and then Noah falls. Fall. This was a crazy fight scene to film. Most of it was like choreographed two hours before we filmed it. All the actors had to, the actors, I say actors, but my friends, all the people that helped out had to learn all the choreo within two hours, film it, you know, everything. And it was a lot of fun to make. This was my first breakdown video. I hope I wasn't too awkward because I normally don't talk in front of the camera and I like to point it at other people.